Hey guys, it's Not Hoops the Bee back with another Bee Swarm Simulator video. Yeah, guys, it's time to get some noob action. That Hoops the Bee guy, he's so OP. But guess what, guys? I'm going to show you today some amazing stuff. Yeah, let's climb this high. Whoa. Oh, level 7 bees. Yeah, guys, this is not good. Look at my backpack. It's got big, though. It's a big backpack. Uh, yeah, I'm going to have to give you some noob tips, guys. Going to have to give you some noob tips. Yeah, I'm not hoops to be, but uh, I can give you some noob tips. Now, check this out, guys. I've got level 7 and 8 bees. 30 bees. Yeah, I did all of that in the Noob to Pro series. Remember that? 12 hours? Wow, I'm amazing. Now, they have been leveled up a little bit, guys. Just a little bit. And I had started the Beastmas. Yes, I have started Beastmas. This is good. All right, let's go over here and uh, talk to the Beastmas. Actually, no, I think I've got things to do, actually. Why am I talking to the Beastmas? spare i think i've got a quest to finish off guys let's do that now and i'm going to give you some hot tips guys i'm going to give you the tips on how to get this business done because it ain't easy as a noob no that's right well mid-range player let's call it mid-range that's 30 bees guys some of you guys have only got like 25 bees and 26 bees and stuff all right let's go and complete this quest what do we need equip four bees to your hive oh quips yeah yeah the, yeah yeah who said about the quips he said put them onto your hive I need to put two on there, guys. Now, let's see which ones we're going to put on. Let's go. This is a beast. Beast top. It's got critical chance and ability rate. Uh, yeah, I plus one attack. Oh, I like attack. Uh, ability rate. Now, what's got an ability rate? Well, the honeybee's got an ability rate. Oh, I like the carpenter bee, actually. So confusing, guys. This equipment stuff is so... Oh, I can't even put it on that one anyway. Or that one. Oh, let's go. Uh, oh, don't even know, guys. I don't even know. I don't even know which one I'm going to put this one on. I could put it anywhere. Uh, well, the look at me has got an ability rate, so let's put it on that. Uh, what else we put another one of these? Convert amount, gather amount, movement speed, ability rate. Again, guys. Wow, that's great. Let's go and put that. Oh, we can put that anywhere. Let's put it on the carpet to be. Yes. Now we should be ready to go. Oh, deliver three presents, guys. All right, the presence is the thing, guys. When you're a noob, you don't want to go and deliver to black bear, brown bear, and mother bear, and all that stuff, because they're going to give you boosts for the fields you want. What you really want to do, go, is you want to go a bit crazy, and you want to go and find the fields the furthest away. So let's go and do that right now. Well, we can get up all the way over to here to science bear. Now, I don't have any translators unlocked, guys. Oh, seriously? I missed it. I missed it by, like, inches. All right, let's go. Guys, let's go and <laughs> try this again. Oh, I Jeez, this hoops to be, guys, so much more pro. All right, let's go. We talk to the science bear. We're going to give the science bear one of these. You know why? Because we're going to get, like, a buff in the pineapple field, which is OP, guys. Uh, let's give a present to you. Yeah. Happy birthday, Mr. Science Bear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so we get a pineapple patch boost, but we also get, like, a boost on the actual tree, guys, on the field itself. So that is a good one to give. Now, you could go and give it to Panda Bear, but he's probably going to do, like, the bamboo. We don't want to do bamboo yet, guys. We don't want to do bamboo yet. So, let's go to the Polar Bear. Oh, let's just let's just make it easier for ourselves, guys. Let's go make it easier for ourselves. So, I've got level 7 and 8 bees, guys. As your bees are leveling up, you actually want to go and do the Polar Bear quest. Because that actually is going to help you a lot. So, let's quickly go up here, guys. Let's go up here, and we'll have a bit of a chat to Mr. Polar Bear. Because I think I've got a quest. Oh, jeez. I nearly missed it, guys. I nearly missed it. Ah, oh, it's such a noob. All right, let's talk to the polar bear, and uh, we'll get this quest done, and we'll get another quest. There we go. We got uh, some more uh, polar power, which is what Hoop says is really good for your bees. They like, look, everybody loves the polar power. All right, now you got to do this, guys. you got to do this. Oh, actually, let's give the present first, and then we'll do the next thing, guys. Let's talk to the polar bear thing again. And uh, we'll give him a present this time. Oh, we want to give him a present. Why can't we give him a present? Let's jump on his thing here. Uh, feed, dig into the beast with fish. Do you want to do this all the time, guys? Because as a noob, this is really going to help your bees level up. What the? Seriously? I just got the bumblebee level up. Crimson bee is just leveled up. What the? Seriously? This is amazing. I got a bunch of bees leveled up just with some polar, some of this polar feasting stuff. Yeah, that's all right. So maybe I've already given polar bear a present or something. No, that's... That's no good, guys. That's no good. All right, so there's probably the two that I would do. I'd probably do Bucko B as well. But look, you know what? I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to deliver one more present, I think. I do have to deliver one more present for this quest. Uh, yeah, I'm going to deliver one. So we're going to give it to the Panda Bear. He's probably going to give me like a bamboo boost or something. Now, guys, I actually uh, like blue, right? Keep that in mind. Oh, boom, boom, boom. 
And boom, there we go. Bamboo field boost, guys. I got a bunch of stuff, a blue extract, everything. Everyone's happy. Let's go and talk to the Beastmas Bear. Now, that's how easy it is, guys. I know this is hard. Guys, grinding is hard as a noob, right? You know why? Because look at me. I'm a noob. And this is, we're going to fix this up. We're going to fix this up, guys. Let's just talk to the Beastmas Bear first. And we'll just get this sorted out. We'll get some, oh, another gift and some jelly beans and some gingerbread. Now, that brings me to the next topic, guys. The gingerbread bears. Look how many I've got. I've got 22, guys. I've already really just started. I'm going to go and collect them over here and uh, make sure I'm, like, on target. Man, you're not going to be able to do everything as a noob, guys. As a noob, you're not going to be able to collect everything in the bee bears catalog, right? So what's my hot tip? Guys, guys, there's only one thing you really need to get out of this catalog. And it's the gingerbread cup buddy. Guys, you need the cup buddy. I know, I know, you know, who says you can get it for free and all that stuff. But it is free. It doesn't cost tickets. It costs 2,000 tickets, guys. Or you can get it in the shop. Or you get it in the shop for like 600 Robux, guys. But this is a no Robux account. Yeah, that's right. I haven't done any Robux, guys. Check this out. No Robux passes. And I did this in 12 hours, remember? Yeah, so I don't actually spend any Robux on this account because I haven't got any Robux. So, there. Yeah, you don't know, basically you want to grind 250 gingerbread by the end of the event. Get yourself the cup, buddy. And you will never, never look back, guys. You will never look back. This is the only way to get it, guys, for free. All right, guys. Now, uh, let's talk about backpack capacity and everything like that. Look at me. I've got a reasonable backpack. I've got like a wand. But guess what? I got 163 million pollen or honey or whatever you want to call it. Yes, yeah, stuff. Let's go shopping. Woohoo! Yes. Finally, guys, I got 150 million and I got 30 bees. So you know what I'm going to buy? You know what I'm going to buy, guys? Let's check it out. Not the rig. Not that thing. Not that thing. Oh, actually, I have a beekeeper's mask already. I really should be equipping that. That's another little tip. Let's leave the shop there. You need to have a beekeeper's mask, guys. This is one of the first masks you should get because it's cheap. Guys, it is so cheap. How cheap? Well, it's only 20 million honey, guys. It is cheap. So you've got to get yourself the beekeeper's mask. Now I'm thinking about this, guys. 150 million. The honey dipper. Finally, I've got the honey dipper. Got... No, guys, don't do it. Don't do it. That's right. I want to get the honey dipper. But, guys, the thing I'm using right now up in this field is almost as good. Yeah, because look at this, guys. I've got, like, a blue wand that does really well with the blue flowers. And there's three flowers up here, which means there's a lot of capacity, guys. So guess what? You're just going to grind a bit, but we need better capacity. So you need to choose whether you want to go blue or red at this stage, guys. Let's go blue, okay? Because my hive is kind of blue, and I want to fix that up as well, get that a little bit better. But for that 150 million, let's see what we can buy. Let's go and open the shop here in the blue headquarters. And we can go past here. And you know what? Let's get one of these bucko guards because it gives us 150,000 capacity. 35% blue pollen, 10% defense, which is going to be great. 75% critical power blue bee attack. Yes, craft item. Boom. Okay, guys. So now we've got one of our key components, right? And we still got lots of money. So let's go shopping again. And this time, we're looking at the Porto Hive, guys. Look at this. We get a capacity of 350,000. Yes, an extra conversion rate, instant blue conversion. And you get plus one blue bee attack. Buy it. Boom. All right, now we're starting to get a little bit pro here, guys. We need one more thing. Let's use the uh, teleporter. Boom. All right, we made it. And let's get up to the red bee. Oh, I know, guys. I know. You say to yourself, what are you doing, hoops? You're red. You're going in the red quarters and you're a blue bee. What are you doing? No, you got to go in here, guys, because this completes it. Look at that, guys. I can open the shop here and I can go crafty, crafty, craft and crafted item. I can get the Riley Guard, too. Look at that. Another 150,000 capacity, 35% red pollen, plus 2 bee attack. Let's get it, guys. This uh, polar bear thing's got no chance. Now look at me, guys. I am fully equipped out. Look at this. How cool do I look? And uh, you know what, guys? I'm going to be able to beat everything now. And uh, I'm not going to get the porcelain dipper. I'm just going to beat away with this thing up in the mountaintop field. Yeah, that's going to be good enough, guys. And you'll get there real quick. But you know what, guys? I've still got 91,000 left over. So you know what I'm going to do with that? Am I going to save it up for the porcelain dipper? No, no, I'm not. I'm going to go and get myself another bee. That's right, guys, because the bees matter. So let's quickly go up here, guys. Let's go up here. I've got 30 bees. We should have got one of these slots before. Save us going in here twice. But this is that new look. I'd like to get those boots. 
but right now no boots okay guys just get the slots for the business event all right so buying for 54 million oh and the next one is 78 guys no problems i'll get one of those next time all right so let's go while we're up here guys you unlock the 30b gate and you got to do this at least once or twice a day okay guys you got to come up here and have a little chat to on it get his quest done and unlock the secrets of the nativity scene yes let's go guys all right let's talk to on it and uh it's a winter wonderland we've got one more present guys so as you see i just got a present that he chats a bit he talks a bit guys this honor guy talks a bit look but it's going to give you an extra fuel boost in the mountaintop field did i not just call it guys i called it another three by the mountaintop right now but we can't unlock the nativity scene with the free gingerbread every day guys until we finish his quest Yes, that's right. So I've got a quest here. Let's have a look how hard it is, guys. Even for noobs. Use 100 snowflakes. Well, that's easy, guys. That's it. You just simply grab your snowflakes. You put them down in your thing and turn auto on. That is 100 snowflakes. Uh, you just keep on letting that go, guys. You've got to feed five gingerbread bears, guys, to your bees. And you're also going to use the wreath and get some falling beesmas lights. Then you can use this every day, guys. It gives you a gingerbread and it gives you an amazing boost on one of the fields. So that is pretty much it, guys. That is pretty much it. That is the noob's guide. This is exactly what you should be doing, guys. This is exactly what you should be doing. I'm going to turn the auto off. I'll leave it on for now. This is exactly what you should be doing. Get to yourself one of these porto hives. Choose red or blue. Get these guards. Get blue and red. And now, and also choose a wand. Either a bubble wand or a scythe. And then you come up into this field up here. And you just grind. Right? And then before you know it, guys... Before you know it, you're going to have something amazing happen. You're actually going to... Look at this, guys. I'm a, a noob solo sprout popper. Look at that. I'm actually doing pretty well right now, guys. Just with a blue wand. You don't need the you don't need the porcelain dipper. You can get the 35 bees first, guys. Get the 35 bees, then get yourself the porcelain dipper as a treat. Now, let's see, guys. Let's see what we get here. We get a bunch of stuff. It's just a bunch, right? So, we just collect all this stuff. But well, you can actually have enough power to do this. Just grab what you can from the field, guys. i got a three by, so I'm going to have to come and do some serious grinding, guys. Oh, look, I've also got a super smoothie activated. Who gave me that? Oh, boy. Everything is happening all at once, guys. I got some serious grinding to do. Look at my backpack. Look at my backpack, guys. It's huge. And look at that. It's almost full. So that is basically it, guys. There's your noob's guide to Beesmus. You want to go ahead and get yourself to 30 bees. You want to go and do the honored quest. He's going to give you a guiding star. That's going to help you grind some, grind some more, right? And he's also going to give you like a super smoothie and a mountain top. That's 30 bees, guys. Get you one of these red or blue porto hives. Get yourself the red and blue guards and a decent dipper or a scythe. That's all you need, guys. Grind it till you get 35 bees and you're done. Anyway, guys, that's all I've got time for today. I've got some serious grinding to do and get some ginger bread so i get myself a gingerbread company for free yay i love it i love it i don't like paying tickets for things guys seriously 2000 tickets is gonna take you like forever anyway guys that's all i've got time for today please like and subscribe and until next time it's bye for now oh still here well after that super boost guys with the super smoothie guess what oh i've got enough to buy another slot and I even forgot to use the other one, guys. I bought uh, another slot, and I also bought two basic bee eggs with that last grind from Onnit. So just keep that in mind, guys. When you give a present to Onnit, it is going to be OP. Make sure you've got a backpack, some guards, and uh, a bunch of converters, guys. I was a bit short on the converters. But anyway, let's go back down to the hive. And uh, let's actually put these basic bee eggs in there. I totally forgot to do that, guys. I totally forgot to do that. I've got 30 and 32. Yeah, that's right. And I didn't get the porcelain dipper, guys. You notice I didn't get the porcelain dipper. And everything turned out just fine. All right, two basic eggs. Let's pop them in. Let's see what we get. Hatch the basic egg. Basic egg. Hatch the basic egg. We get a basic egg. Now, I could use a gold, guys. But I don't want to use gold. Because, well, if I use gold, I think, well, let's go all out, guys. Let's go all out. I've got two star jellies. Let's get a gifted rascal bee. And let's get another gifted bee here. Boom. A gifted shock bee. How cool is that, guys? So that is a bunch of amazing bees I've got in my hive now, guys. I'm going to have to level them up for sure. And I also need to feed some gingerbread. But I might do that in the next video, guys. That is not Hoops the Bee, guys. Showing you how to do it as a noob. Well mid-range noob anyway anyway guys that's all i got time for today please like and subscribe and until next time it's bye for now